All right, me and Fat Mike are doing the tour. <laughs> I know, right? Crazy. What's happening, everybody? Danny Punk's Life right here at the Punk Rock Museum. I've been waiting for years for this, and now I am stoked. I get to check it out. Fat Mike's in there. Monkey from the Addicts is right there. Check this out, man. First thing you walk in, you see this, the CBGB. Anybody know what that stands for? Comment down below. What does that stand for, Justin? <laughs> what do you think it stands for? Close. <laughs> All sorts of cool photos right here. Check this out, man. Another good look. CBGBs. Does anybody know who that is? Any guesses? Henry Rollins right here, lead singer of Black Flag and the Henry Rollins band. This is a, just the entrance of this place. Looks really cool, huh, babe? Really, really cool. Got the gift shop area right here. But we're gonna head in there to the actual museum. Check this out, and before I take a look at the merchandise, my wife's already looking at the merchandise. <laughs> Check this out, Tony Sly from New Houston Name. Sadly, we lost Tony back in 2012. Died in his sleep. But this is also Fat Mike's best friend. But right here, one of the greatest songwriters in the punk scene, hands down. Of course, what kind of museum would this be if they didn't have Blink 182, Coachella vibes right here? You have Tom, Mark, and Travis right there. Warp Tour, 99. Darby Crash from the germs. And then we have a large Tim from Rancid right here. Check out these TV sets. They're really, really cool. We have signatures from the Ramones. A bunch of different mix of punk rockers. Look how awesome this is. This is actually Joan Jett's jacket. This is right here. Joan Jett's jacket. <laughs> these memorabilia, old flyers. This is way cool. We have Monkey from the Attics doing the tour. Way freaking cool, man. Punk rock legend right there. Viva La Revolution. Dead boy flyers right here. Dead boys, dead boys, dead boys. Look at this. This is love the Ramones, man. Ramones is one of my all-time favorite bands. It's awesome just to see. And here is a bass from the Ramones. Yeah, we have Blondie right here. Blondie's punk rock. Blondie is punk rock. The gods themselves. The Misfits. Way, way cool. Why wouldn't the Pop Rock Museum have the Misfits? These guys are literally the best. Look at that set list. Big giant set list right there. Walk Among Us. That's a Halloween EP. More photos of the Misfits. This is so cool. Jerry only. Definitely be into the horror genre, the misfit. Speaking of horror and rockabilly, the craps. Cool. We have Sid. Sid himself. Sid Vicious used to cut himself. This is the definition of a true punk rocker. Some people say Gigi Allen, but Sid was doing it first. Photos of the craps. Pants with Sid. And I don't have the pound number anymore. Anarchy and the UK. The Sex Pistols. There's Glenn's base right there from the Sex Pistols. And a cool little photo. Sorry about the glare, but 
of the sex pistols. One of the biggest swindles in punk rock music. If it wasn't for Malcolm, we would have gotten these guys. Fun fact, Johnny Ronnie actually wanted to call God Save the Queen No Future, but everybody agreed that God Save the Queen sounds a lot better. I have to agree. Sorry, Johnny. Generation X, we have The Clash, The Damned, and The Toy Dolls. Nelly, the Ali, fuck. Nobody talks to Billy that way. <laughs> More photos on the wall. Photos on the wall, memorabilia. Agent Orange, seen them a bunch of times. Mike Palm, she got this guitar from Social D. More jackets, more social distortion guitars, pictures of Bad Religion, Black Flag, and many, many more. More guitars from the Germs. Is that Pat Smears guitar? It is Pat Smears guitars from the Germs and the Foo Fighters. Jonesy shirt, and then, if you haven't seen that movie, The Decline of Western Civilization. Punk rock cinema right there. There's a picture of Rodney on the rocks right there. How cool is that, man? They dedicated something to him. He's a punk rock legend as well. K-Rock. This is, these photos are, Simply amazing, man. Check out these VHSs right here, CBGBs, the flip side DVDs, Suburbia. Look at this boombox. This is awesome with the cassettes. It's black flag on there. More. That's how it was, man. You, you can afford a concert, you can afford a VHS, or go to a yard sale. Why not? I grew up with these things. I saw a lot of my bands live. <laughs> and I paid a lot of money when I grew up to see all these bands when they're old. There's Lucky's drum set with these weird noodle shaped toms right here from the Circle Jerks. More instruments from different people from like Rancid, Social Distortion, many, many, many more. Some more toms and basses. This is cool, man. That's TSOL's orange amp right there. Black flag. Scream. Does anybody know who Scream is? Well, fun fact, Scream was Dave Grohl's first band before Nirvana. And the Foos. How sick is that? Dave Grohl's jump set. Right there. She got these A-tracks right here. Awesome, and then this little doohickey right here plays A-tracks, and when you did a pump on that, it changed the track. That's awesome. Little Panasonic hand pump A-track player. Oh, we're not, man. We are the evil. The evil. Evil. Check this out, Devo's hats in the original mold. To make these hats, these little electric dome hats. I want one of these at home because I am a Devo fan. What are you doing, babe? Hanging out in the living room? Yeah? Does this remind you of growing up a little bit? Reminds me of my old house, just a little bit, and less flyers. But the furniture and stuff, for sure. Photo of Fat Mike right here. A bunch of different types of flyers. Flyers galore here. A lot of personal photos, I'm sure, from Fat Mike's collection himself. I'm pretty sure this is actual furniture from his living room. What do you think, dude? Dope. Dope. Got this surfboard right here. No use for names. Set list on it. Really cool. Television set. I've heard that this is Fat Mike's original skateboard. Which is way cool. They have a library here. 
respect the books and make sure you put them back. It's a cool photo of the misfits right here. Jerry only, Doyle. And there's Glenn right there. He's getting pummeled on the ground. Rock bowling trophies right here. We know Mike has been a champion multiple times, but look how cool this is. Boom, 2010 champ. And there's Fat Mike right there. I think he's putting out his tour right now. All right, me and Fat Mike are doing the tour. <laughs> I know, right? Frenzy. She's out. Beastie Boys. People don't know they were punk rock at one point before they were the rap group. Boots, some D pads, <laughs> DC hardcore, HR right there, the bad brains, Iron Cross, Black Flag, Henry Rollins is originally from DC, so is Dave Grohl. It's a diverse section. We have the offspring. Back when uh, Dex had dreads. There's noodles right there. Back when he had less spiky hair and wearing shorts. Of course. They have Taken Back Sunday, Bowling for Soup. Punk's Big Break. With the Dwarfs, Green Day, Bad Religion. Offspring, and many, many more. There's Brent's guitar from Bad Religion, and then Noodle's guitar, and then the amp for Dexter's first guitar he's ever owned. His first amp, it's PB. Billy Joel's guitar for all my Green Day fans, and Dirk's bass, and their Grammy. Actually, that's Nirvana's Grammy. How crazy is that? It's Kurt Cobain's jacket right here. This is cool. Nirvana and the Butthole Surfers. Nirvana and the Meat Puppets. This is awesome. So surreal. Check out this PA. Jabber Jam. Kurt Cobain's. Hey Justin, whose couch is this? It's my couch. your couch now? Kurt who? That's right. Kurt Cobain's couch. And the records. Right there, yeah. Straight ahead, Pennywise, Rancid. There's a photo of Kurt Cobain right there. And then there's a photo of Justin right here. A new Kurt Cobain. <laughs> you wish. L7. Weenie. Whole wall of Zines. Punk magazine. Flip side. Just like the cassettes out there. Maximum rock and roll. Punk magazine. I had a few of these back in the day. It's good to see them here. More flyers. Flyers galore. And then Operation IV. I think we're heading to the fat section. One of the most successful independent record companies ever. Created by Fat Mike. Fat Rec Records. All sorts of bands, Ladwagon, New Year's, her name. Even, even Rise Against was on this label at one point in the beginning of the career. Really, really cool. Thank you, Fat Mike. Definitely the best in the business. Well, right next to Epitaph. <laughs> Check this out. Little puppet of Fat Mike. A bunch of different memorabilia from me first in the Gimme Gimme's all of Fat Mike's yeah, projects. Coming. Stone yeah. beer. Punk and drop look. That stuff was great, but I don't drink no more, and this don't exist no more. It's a sick record player. Bit of Aaron right there. Mike's ex-wife. Partner of Fat Records. Mother of his child, no effects surfboard. <laughs> Some broken guitars, records, sandals, jackets, more guitars, and Kung Fu records. 
little sign right there. Hello, Cool J2. Nice photo of against the grain base from Pennywise. More flyers. Cool thing about this. You know whose base this is? Jason Thurks. Rest in peace. This one's for you. Joey Escalante's base and jacket. Kung Fu Records. Vandals, baby. We got the street punks right here. This section's cool. Bunch of different types of clothing. Casualties. The gutter punks. I like to call them. I think they're, uh, they are called the street punks, gutter punks. And then you have the skull section right here. Mighty Mighty Boss Tones. Less than Jake. All these different jackets right here. My boys from Begin the Rough Riders are here. They'd be loving this right now. I'll probably try to jack these things. Sick. Check out this garage right here. Literally, it's a garage. And this is a replica of Pennywise's jam room. How sick is this? This is way cool. Amps, bass, PAs, boom boxes, different types of posters on the wall. Wow. Rest in peace. He's Matthew Church. This, there's Fletch's guitar right there. This is awesome. Then Jim's mic. It smells like a garage. This is the actual carpet from that garage room, that jam room. Sick. There's set list right here. Probably plans for the shows, the future to come, but pretty sick. The suicidal tendency display. This is sick. Look at this. Bases. That ruptured heels base? No. Oui, <laughs> cheek. But look at the original Pepsi can from the music video. All I wanted was a Pepsi. Just a Pepsi. But she wouldn't give it to me. Just a Pepsi. I like it, but. The plasmatics. I remember watching a Christmas special with John Candy talking about the plasmatics. Subhumans. DOA. Monkey talking about himself. I almost thought that said Scott on tape. But it says only Scottish date. What's up, Scott? What's up, Robert Lance's drawings? Who is suicidal? Original. There's Gabby from Manic Hispanic. Skateboards. More stickers. Backstage passes. No way. Tony Hawk just showed up. You got Tony Hawk, Fat Mike, and Monkey right there. How freaking rad is this? Do a kickflip. How sick is this? Tony Hawk right in front of me. This is insane, man. I gotta meet Monkey again. I met Monkey back, oh boy, in high school, or maybe even junior high. I think it was high school, seeing the addicts at the warehouse in Hemet, California. A long, long time ago with my boys. Um, Man, a long time ago. Um, met Monkey back then, a bunch of other different people. Um, Fat Mike, first time I met him, lovely guy. He's a sweetheart. And uh, Tony Hawk, man, Tony Hawk. You know, I told Tony right now, I said my mom would like to thank him because he kept me and my brothers out of trouble. So, how cool was that? Having fun, babe? And this is the triple rock, the triple down, punk rock. Hit the punk rock museum. Just a bar. Chilling, pretty, 
pretty empty. Everyone's doing the tour right now with Fat Mike and Tony Hawk. Check this out. It's one of those drink specials. It's called the Fletcher. It's a rum and coke and a Pringles can. And guess what? You gotta eat the Pringles. That's not mine. That's mine. That's <laughs> my wife's. These are my chips though. Yes. Oh my California punkers. We all know what this place is. You like tattoos? Come get one at the Pop Rock Museum. Open. May 1st. Cool little tattoo parlor. Little memorial area for Sid and Nancy. Sid wishes and Nancy, the uh, were lovebirds, and um, allegedly Sid killed Nancy and Sid offed himself due to a drug overdose. Another look at Sid and Nancy. This is a wedding chapel right here, so you can get a tattoo and get married, or you get married, then go get a tattoo. Whatever works. It's the upstairs area, more mannequins and photos. And of course, flyers. You can be interrupter from the interrupters. Yeah. Check it out. Turnstile. I love this woman. Don't touch Aggie. Some 41. Bad cop, bad cop. Davey Havoc. Come on. If I. More concert memorabilia. Things that have been used in live shows, backstage passes, backstage passes, guitars, beers from Stone, and of course, the pop punk scene. Ugh. Gabby, Gabby, hey. This one is for Adam the Woo. He was in Guttermouth at one point. Shout out to Adam the Woo. He said no metal allowed, except me. I'm the only metalhead here. Actually, I'm a speed metal punk. Different kind of breed. Hey, I met this guy at Disneyland. <laughs> Acoline Trio, Taking it Back Sunday, Good Charlotte, more <laughs> pop punk, and Blink 182. Well, he's not from Brooklyn, but still. Cool mannequins. This is the queen. Princess. Peaches, 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 peaches. More shoes, jackets, vests, masks from the mask intruders. These guys are funny. If you ever get a chance to, ch to check these guys out, see them. They are great. The distillers left over crack. Fat Mike. Cookie the Clown. Thank you, Fat Mike, for having us and making this awesome museum. Cookie's coat and jacket. And she got this base. It's made from a wash tub. Look how sick this is. A freaking wash tub. My buddy Mike from making the Rough Riders will dig this. This base right here Chest, yeah, right there yeah, from Wasted actually, Youth. Like, when you play it as a writing, Eric, like, Fletcher's guitar and amp from Pennywise. And I believe he bought this amp from Metallica. <laughs> How freaking sick is that? 5150 from that Strung Mike, Out. This is awesome, man. Yeah, this is awesome. So that won't the stick, that's Mike's. Oh, yeah. Yeah, TSOL or? Yeah, it's Mike TSOL, that Mike. And this is Mike from MXP. That's Tim's uh, guitar, huh? Tim, Lefty? Tim's guitar, yeah. yeah. Norwood from Fishbone. Pete from The Addicts. Zach from Rise Against. Joan Jett. Me first in the Gimme Gimme. Wait, which one's Joan Jett's? The white one on the wall. Oh, wow. That is sick. Yeah, Me first in the Gimme. They always had those weird looking guitars. Uh -huh. And then and the way Murphy's Wasted You. Chet. Fletcher from Pennywise and then uh, Pete from Sick of the, the, the big Wookiee from Pennywise uh -huh. <laughs> looks to tackle Fat Mike on stage. Exactly. <laughs> this is sick, man. Check this out. Joan Jett's guitar right here. That has been through the This is rad. And if you want, you can play any of these instruments right here. Obviously, Tim's, Fat Mike's, Mike's from TSOL. Many, many more. Even Fletcher's. 
awesome, huh? Well, damn. You got picks? Yeah, man. Going right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Metallica one, huh? Yes. Yeah. Get a shot of that, man. The Metallica app. Mark my territory, send your center him at Punk's. Danny, Punk's life. Fat Mike got my autograph. How awesome is that? Uh oh. Buck Fex is on the tube. Today has been surreal, man. When Tony Hawk walked in, it just blew my freaking mind, dude. Fat Mike's cool, but you know, we all know how he kind of is. Fat Mike was cool. Monkey was cool. Tony Hawk. Dream come true. And that's gonna do it for today. Hit the Punk Rock Museum in Las Vegas. Thank you, Fat Mike, and all the people who donated. You guys rock on this Fat Mike right there. He's leaving his entourage in the DeLorean in the background there. Punk Rock and Back to the Future. The vlog is over.